In Thailand today is Songkran. It's the Thai New Year. We had our New Year celebration early, so we could have it on the weekend. Of course, it's a convention. The sun doesn't have a sign on it when it rises at any one point saying, this is the beginning of a new year. It doesn't have a name for the new year or a number. But we can make use of the convention. When you start a new year, it's good to think about the past year, the things you did well, the things you did not so well. And tell yourself, I'm going to make this new year a better year. After all, the body is getting older. It's beginning to wear down. So you want to get something good out of it while you can. And the goodness here, of course, doesn't mean just pleasures. It means real goodness in terms of virtue, generosity, meditation. You want to think about the fact that every day is actually a new beginning. Think about your past actions and things that you didn't do so well, well, make up your mind you're going to do them better the next time around. So even though this is just a convention, we can make use of it. And we had a chance with January 1st to start the new year, and if it didn't start so well, here's another chance. To think of how you can improve your life even as the body's getting older. As this time passes on, it just gets closer and closer to the time when we're going to have to leave the body. So take care of the body in the sense of making it strong enough so it can keep on doing good. But the goodness is the important thing you want to squeeze out of the body. There's an old woman one time who went with a friend to a Jamahabwa. The friend was suffering from cancer, and the old woman was a doctor. And the doctor, John Mahabwit, said he can't, couldn't look after the woman's medical needs. She would have to get a doctor to come along with her. So she got this old retired doctor, an old lady, over 80 years old. And they recorded all the talks that John Mahabwit gave during that period. Three months was almost every night, 80-plus talks. So then after the woman with cancer died, they had this big pile of tapes, recorded talks. So the old woman decided, okay, even though I'm old, my eyesight is not all the good, I'm not that strong, I want to see how much goodness I can squeeze out of the body. I want to transcribe all those tapes. And she managed to do it. So as the body's getting older, you want to get as much goodness out of, it, out of it as you can before it doesn't let you do that goodness anymore. So think of the new year as an opportunity to squeeze some more goodness out of the body, squeeze some more goodness into your mind. In that way, the convention serves a purpose.